All right. So the next match is up. The fighters, Alpha Dash and Squeechu. This awesome. is winner semis round one. Are you ready? I am ready. Perfect. Let's do this. Three, two, one, go. Apologies for the wait, guys. Here we go. So this is an interesting fight. Purely because I know that Squeechu hates playing against Drifter. Drifter is... moves really fast. It really invalidates yeah. a lot of what Volt does, which is getting that keep away game going. It is 100% his worst matchup, both in terms of character, I would say, and in terms of- Oh my of god, that, <laughs> that DI! Oh, that was- that, Squeechu that was DIing the wrong direction that. every single hit. Yeah, that was an absolutely brutal combo that could have really been avoided. Yeah, so he yeah, DI- he DI'd into that combo the entire way through. He did. It was like he wanted to get hit. <laughs> Uh, nice yeah, play by Alpha Dash. I like his movement. His movement is very good, and w well, what would you expect from someone who's been playing Smash for so long? And that was really good recovery. I wasn't expecting him to be able to recover from so far back there. Yeah, I like how he's playing the platforms. He's not letting Squeechu get his Thundercloud game going. Of course, Anytime I mean, you see C the... Squeechu get take to the air, he just goes beneath one of the side platforms. Yeah, he's playing. He's playing him a little bit as as how I describe someone playing Seth, which is a bit like a bullfighter. He's just trying to edge out those moves. Yeah, Squeechu loves just whittling away at his opponent slowly over time, playing a keep away game. Alpha Dash is willing to be patient though. He has the lead. He doesn't need to approach yet. Yep, it's. Uh, if Squeechu definitely... wants, if Squeechu wants to take this to time out. Alpha Dash is clearly willing to play that game. And we know that Squeechu has done that in the past. Yeah, definitely. Ooh, gets a sour spot on up here. That could have been a kill. Could have been, but it wasn't quite there, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. Alpha Dash lost his air dodge. Makes it back, though. Squeechu not yeah. going off stage to fight him. I'm really impressed with uh, Alpha Dash's recovery. Whenever I've played Drifter, I've always found it really hard to recover. Nice up air so from different. Squeechu. That was really nice, catching him just oh. with the tail end of that janky janky hitbox. I love the way Squeechu actually cancelled that out at the end. NICE REFLECT! <laughs> that was, uh... You don't see that often. No, you <laughs> really don't! <laughs> let, let me put it that way. It's really hard to respond to, to the speed at which those thorns come out. <laughs> Still the Avadash sitting at 6%, one stock down, but Squeechu at 156. Drifter yeah, has a little bit of trouble killing. His best kill move is definitely his back air, but landing that on a standing volt is going to be hard. It is. Uh, I, would, I would say that if he hits the sour spot on an up air, it's not quite going to kill. So he, he definitely needs a good hit. And with Drifter, that can be difficult sometimes. Not only that, Squeechu's not going to go close to him if he doesn't have to. Squeechu has the lead. He is going to play his keep away game. He's playing it well! He is! I was a little bit worried for Squeechu at the beginning of this fight, but... He seems to have cottoned on to how Alpha Dash moves, and... There's that back air! Well, yeah, there's the back air. As I say that, the old classic commentator's curse. Alright, still what though. I, what I'd really like to see from Squeechu is, uh, the old... Ooh, the old bad DI! Stage. Very bad DI! Squeechu, please. DI, buddy. It's a thing. <laughs> you see, he's DIing out. To actually escape Drifter's uh, up tilt, you need to DI inwards towards your opponent. Yeah. But that's the thing that a lot of players are very cautious, I would say, about doing. Still squeeze you in the lead, but not by very much. No, this is a deficit of only 28%. Ooh, I like what Squeechu went for there. Yeah, that, that would have been... That would have been kill. It would have Especially on Aztec, which has, you know, these really narrow blast zones. Yeah, the blast zones are tiny. At this point, either character with a kill move will be killed. Ooh, good up air, falling through the platform with it. Nice! Alpha Dash taking the stock lead. Yeah, that was an impressive... Uh... Impressive kill there, once again just flipping it over, but it's still not exactly incredibly in Alpha Dash's favor. 
if he dies, Squirtu hasn't taken very much percent yet. Not yet. It's still anyone's game. There it is! Up air! Easily Volt's yeah. best move, I think. Definitely. Uh, if you can hit it, because it has got quite a janky bit of a hitbox. You do have to get both hits to get the full impact, but still a good move. A hundred percent, as shown off just then. Alpha Dash, really chasing him down now. Yeah, but it feels like he's panicking a little bit, and he doesn't really need to. <laughs> because he is ahead. Single standing laser. I mean, it's clearly the most optimized way to play Drifter. Nearly got that up there. That wouldn't have killed Squeechu, but it would have put him close to the blast zone. See, oh, I think Alpha Dash has realized, yes, I can just tack on damage as well as you can. <laughs> he's not he's not chasing him anymore. He's nope, gonna have he to now though. Yeah, now he will have to. He's two percent behind. This is possibly one of the closest games we're gonna see today. You know, playing, just watching Squeechu is always really weird, because it's like, he he knows how he wants to win the game, and he doesn't care if he takes all your stocks, he just wants to get the lead and stay there. Yeah, and it's a completely fair way of winning, I would say. No, it's it's a viable strategy, it's just that when it comes to act, people playing this game, he's the only one I ever see go for it. I mean, I would say that's because Brawlout is such a fast-paced game. And uh, none of us that... have really got the patience. Ooh. <laughs> Squeechu taking game one over Alpha Dash. Yeah, that was a really good back air, which is is definitely one of Squid Squeechu's favored and best moves. Sweet Jesus. <laughs> it, it is always really strange to watch Squeechu play. And to be honest, it was even stranger to see someone respond to that in almost exactly the same way. Yeah, no, Alpha Dash saw the game that Squeechy was playing and went, I can do this too. Yeah, and almost did it better. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Game two between Alpha Dash and Squeechy is up. Yeah, Are I am ready. ready. I cool. am. So, three, two, one, go. Interesting This is interesting. I say... Wait, no, this would have been Squeertoo's pick, right? That's... I would say this favors... No, this is definitely Alpha Dash's stage pick. I like choice, too. Oh yeah, of course. No, it would be Alpha. I thought Alpha Dash won for some reason. I don't know, maybe that's good projecting. Good combo from Alpha Dash. Cancels into the deflector. That was an absolutely sublime combo there. Really love the uh, side B and the down B. Ooh, this is the second deflector combo though, that's okay. Well, I'd say that Squidge is probably a little bit too high of a percent to be able to get that off reliably now. He's got oh, that blip that blip. Fully blip charged blip. up smash. Oh, that would have been amazing if that landed. Just trying to call it out, but Squidge is seeing it. Like, nah, it's not that Maybe 15% more, that would have been a kill on the top blast zone. Yeah, I'd say Alpha Dash is, uh, is definitely performing much better this he, game, which is crazy, because he wasn't exactly performing badly last game. He's spending a lot of meter this game, though. They Well, yeah, they both are. Luckily, neither of these characters have got crazy kills. Ooh, and nice patience from Alpha Dash, but struggles getting back. Oh. Yeah, that oh. was unfortunate. All right, Alpha Dash down one stock. Squeechu at one forty-two percent, though. Yeah, almost he... anything will kill. Once again, though, Drifter's kill potential isn't as high as his combo game. Oh, up air? No. No, that was um, he didn't quite time that correctly. Squeechu needs to play his air game carefully, though, because Alpha Dash is not going to be able to land a uh, a back air against a grounded bolt, but an airborne bolt. It's a lot I mean, easier. Squirtu playing his air game carefully is basically just Squirtu on a normal day. Nice! Up, oh, smash, seals out. Squirtu's first stock. Both players on two stocks. Alpha Dash with a 55% deficit. But with the, as we're saying about Drifter's combo potential, that is by no means a deficit. He cannot just 
get back in an instant. Definitely not. He can go from 0 to 50 very quickly. But that's only if he can get close, and at the moment, Squidge just isn't letting him get close. No, not really. That is going to be it for... Oh, no! He comes back! I misjudged the amount of distance that Drifter could go! Yeah, that was a crazy recovery, as I said in the last game. I've never seen a Drifter be able to recover this good before. <laughs> <laughs> I like Alpha Dash is willing to fight... Oh, wow! Squidge, you're barely beating him out of that Alpha Dash, however, getting hit by the Quill on the get-up... No! Oh! Didn't need to go down there. I think he was trying to fake squeeze you out, but just misjudged how far he could go after the attack. Yeah, but this now becomes a much, much harder fight for Alpha Dash. He's a stock down, but not just that. He's a lot of percent down, too. Squeeze you back on his keep away game. Yep, and Squeeze you really doesn't need to approach anymore. And no? It's surprising to see that he is, really. You know what? Once Squeechu has the lead, typically he just hangs back, but... Yeah, this is a very aggressive form from Squeechu. Ooh, good back air. Not... Oh, that will be enough to kill him! Yeah, that's enough. That's it! Squeechu with the last bop sending Alpha Dash down to the bottom blast zone, taking the set 2-0. That was a really impressive game from Squeechu. He just figured out how Alpha Dash moves in the first game, and in the second game he used it to full effect. Well, we'll see Alpha Dash again. He drops down I'm into loser's bracket. I'm sure he definitely wants revenge on Squeechu after that game. I would.